No, that's a blue pole. It's the beginning, you can't really see it because the sun's in the way. But that says begin Route 66. Starting point for the journey. It's a beautiful morning here in Chicago. Nice and cool. Let's go have an adventure. All right, we just wiggled our way out of Chicago and we are on our first interstate of the day, I-55 South. Uh, just done this for a couple miles and we'll hop back out onto roads that were formerly known as Route 66. We're in Joliet, Illinois right now. Uh, going through this little part of town. There's an old school bridge here, which is really cool. And a Renault Duster in front of me, which is a strange car to see in Illinois. This is the Abraham Lincoln National Cemetery. Uh, admittedly, should probably maybe know a little bit more about where I'm going, but I don't. I'm really winging this trip. I don't know if this is where Lincoln is buried or if it's just a cemetery named after him. But, but that's kind of why I turned in here to find out. Okay, so there's my answer. It is not where Lincoln is buried. It is a national cemetery for our service men and women. That's a giant rocket man. That's a giant rocket man. Yeah, that's a uh, snowmobile. I guess we're waiting for winter around here. Check out this old school gas station here. The old gas pumps. Old cars inside. For sale. I wonder if it's actually for sale. This is cool. Old school cars. Check out this spot. A standard oil station. Literally just a quarter of a mile down the road from where I just was. And this one is fully refurbished, it's open, they're selling t-shirts and stuff inside with a really old school gas pump. We pulled over here off Route 66 by this cornfield and this old railroady building. Flew the drone around a little bit. This is a fully operational video store. Video store. Not Netflix. Go in and rent movies. New movies. So, so far in Atlanta, I've seen a place that had $2 burgers. Um, this road? Holy cow! This is a small town. The sign said 1649 on the way in and that's a giant dude holding a... Giant dude holding a hot dog. Giant dude holding a hot dog. Giant dude holding a hot dog. But this is one of the original sections. Built in 1926. I know you can see that sign and that was pretty. Uh, bad cameranship of me, cameramanship of me. That, my friends, is a 30 foot tall Abe Lincoln. We are now in Springfield, Illinois, uh, apparently the home of Mr. Lincoln. So, we're gonna go do some Lincoln hunting, see what we can find. Giant Lincoln head. Apparently, you rub his nose for good luck. You can see how worn it is, it's gotten many rubs. And this is the Lincoln Tomb and Memorial. Uh, pretty cool. So I guess I found the answer to my earlier question. He's in uh, Springfield, Illinois, right next to Homer. Now inside the tomb itself, a lot of Lincoln stuff in here. They said I could take pictures. So I'm guessing video is okay too. You can pause if you want to read. Well, for the 
first time today, we are about to enter a new state. Illinois has been great, but now it's time to cross the mighty Mississippi and enter into the great state of Missouri, the Show Me State. It's a really cool bridge going over the mighty Mississippi. A really narrow, freaky bridge. Uh, I'm not scared, you're scared. There's the Archie thing. Uh, just crossed it, state line. Tiny little sign. Totally missed it. Woohoo! Alright, so even though I've never been to St. Louis, I have made the executive decision that I'm gonna skip it. I think I'm close enough to it in Nashville that I can come back here and spend like a weekend in St. Louis instead of trying to cram it into this weird time that I'm here. So I am gonna take Interstate 44 West towards Tulsa and uh, we'll hop back on Route 66 once we get a little bit outside of St. Louis. Just crossed into the town of Bourbon, Missouri. Uh, it's been raining and not a great ride so far through Missouri. So hopefully I can find a place to have dinner, maybe here in Bourbon. Just ate dinner at the Circle Inn Malt Shop. This place is the definition of a little nothing by the road, but had a pretty good meal there. Good burger, decent fries, nice people in there, watch a little bit of the Cardinals game. I've always wanted to go to Cuba. I never imagined it would be Cuba, Missouri. I didn't know Cuba, Missouri was a thing, but I'm here. There's not much here, but I'm here. That is a giant. Red rocking chair, the Route 66 Red Rocker. All right, Interverse, day one, official day one, day two of the trip is in the books. I uh, got tired of driving in the rain. Really the whole point of this is to see the country. So at night I'm gonna stop driving because I can't see anything. Get to bed, get another start tomorrow, hit day two. Definitely gonna get to Kansas. I should get into Oklahoma as well. Get into some places I've never been before. Actually, that's a lie. I've driven through Oklahoma, but, and Kansas. So, should be really cool. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe, share with your friends, and uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you think. See you guys next time.